Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included, the automation update. Well, it's now the tubular update. Excuse me. <laughs> but today we are going to be expanding the base. Now, I'm going to have to move all of these memorials somewhere much further out. This is the edge of the map. Actually, is that actually cold? The outside... Is the outside wall actually cold? I cannot tell because I can't see it what, where the, it's intersecting a hot biome. N no, I cannot see it while it's intersecting a warm biome. So, but it does, it actually does say it is cold though, right? Yeah, it's actually very cold. So, hmm. Anywho, let's actually maybe just make a room that is a proper memorial site. Anyways, let's get some ladders in here too, nonetheless. Oh wait, nope, sorry, I'm, I'm sorry, nope, cancel that. We have it just going up through the middle, right? Yeah. Okay, so let's get a ladder in here. Or pause it not cancel the tool I'm on ah that's fine let's just draw this out ah okay so there's gonna be some stuff we're gonna have to cancel <laughs> okay and let's build that down let's cancel these mistakes out I'm gonna have to finish that up in a moment Okay, base, pneumatic doors, iron, there, 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 and there. And then we dig out all of that. While putting in a bunch of air tiles, too. So we'll need one there, and then we go around. And I'll wait till those are built to actually do those. They'll probably put these in first, tell the truth. Because that's just the effective way of doing it. They have that one in, so we'll let them work on that for the time being. We do need to dig that out. <laughs> the sand has fallen and has entombed some stuff. Let's just hope it doesn't drop on anyone specifically. Medic door. We can deconstruct and deconstruct. Oops. And then a pneumatic door right there as well. Oops. And a whole bunch of air tiles up going going up through this. Like that. There we go. Now this isn't going to be too heavily oxygenated. Actually, there's not a lot of oxygen in the base here. We should get another vent over there, similar to the other one. So, let's see here. It just continues straight down to here. And then goes across and into here. Oops. You cancel. Let's make that out of iron. We have no more iron. Okay, well that's fine. We can always dig some more up. So dig up. Let's see if there's any more easily accessible that we can just grab real quick. Just through there. That is, that is indeed iron. And that looks like all the cherry pick that we can do. Yeah. That looks like about all the cherry picking we can do. But they should be able to get those just fine. We can dig down and get some of... Or build a ladder and get down here and get some of this. Oh dear, there's... A bomb lily right there. 
Let's see here. One, two, three, four. So we can dig all that out. And that actually does get to about two above that, so that's good. What? Overheating? Pipe block, repair task. That's... Oh, okay. Actually, can we... Can we just deconstruct that? We will actually replace it with a gold amalgam pump. Or, or, yeah, gold amalgam pump. Yeah, it's hot. Just make sure to get it done. And plop. And we, did we accidentally get rid of the wire or the pump? No, we didn't. Okay. Can we have this? Well, actually, that's not even running at the moment, so it's fine. You guys can get that done whenever you need. Are they down here mining this up yet? Well, there is some iron right there. Let's see if we can put that vent in. Yes, we can. There we go. Okay, there is some digging that needs to be done because of falling sand. And germs. This is getting infected, but it looks like it's handling itself for the most part. So I'm not going to worry about that too much. I am going to deconstruct, deconstruct, and deconstruct for now. Base, let's put in some other pieces. Some of those doors might not be iron. Suffocating, okay, one second. Yeah, I like that door. Oh. How did you get down there? Well, we do need this done, so priority nine and red alert because she's in danger of dying. Come on, people. Get stuff down here. Oh, nope, she died. Okay, well, we tried. Go back to bed. Anyway, so we do actually need a proper memorial site for all of our dead dupes, I do believe. So, let's actually build one over here, I think. Down on this level, because we're not going to do anything under here, and we can actually still have the ladder come down into here. Let's dig up those. And actually dig up this, because we could use that elsewhere. And mop. Really? Are we going to have to keep disinfecting that? It says it's zero surface germs now, so... Yes, I know duplicates have died. So how many do we need from our <laughs> epic... Issue. So that's five, ten, fifteen, twenty. Oh, we have, we do have another spot for him or for her once we get down to her, but. Oh, and she's already been taken. Okay, so we need a lot. Let's just say that. Good thing this water basin is deep, so therefore we can have a good number of them. So, they are only too tall. So, that would be eight per. So, three at the moment. Why can I? Oh. Oh, really? Um. And that is a nine. I don't know how you got in there, but. Oh. 
Or, oh, gosh. Deconstruct that. Yes, I know. <laughs> Stupid dupes. <laughs> I don't know why they can't get that. Okay, well, we're going to need a ladder in here either way as well before anyone gets trapped and suffocates. <laughs> But, that should be helping with the oxygen, though. Indeed it is. There's more oxygen over here. And how is this doing? Very good. So, it's really hot in the bedrooms at the moment, too. Overpressurized. Yeah, I guess we don't need a lot of the air that's actually in here. Ooh, that's backed up. That side's backed up. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, not that one. Deconstruct that one. That. Cancel deconstruct. That is not good. <laughs> we don't want... Chlorine in the base anywhere, that's for sure. Yeah, so that's why that's backing up. Okay, so we will say a bridge for the one going up. And we'll just put a gas pipe through. That's probably not how it is over here. No, it's not. <laughs> but that's fine. Anyways, they should build that fairly quick. Can we then dig that up? Yeah, we can. Okay. And then dig up all of that. And then we'll do one more layer. Just in case there's new, new dupes that die. Because they're bound to. <laughs> And in here doesn't really need to have any oxygen at all. It's a graveyard, so only the dead in there. And in fact, there's n not really a lot of air at all in there at all. <laughs> so should actually be fairly cool because it is. And air is coming in through the door when they open it. They'll get that done quick enough. So let's place that in and let's start planning our next move which is actually the oil systems now I don't want them down there I could have them go through here but all this is melting anyways and it's not going to stay cool forever so let's not rely on that necessarily but we will need I think our refineries right here and then we'll have well actually let's do it below this because that's going to be a pain so our refineries like right here and then our power systems off to the side here and then maybe the the super heavy watt needs to go through here I wish you could deconstruct these really do like, what are they made of? Details. They're only made of obsidian. So... Have we seen obsidian before? <laughs> I don't know if that's an actual element here. Um, raw minerals. Yeah, obsidian. They're only made of obsidian. Why can't we take them apart? Like, I get the concept that it's... Yeah, for like the trick stuff, then make them, make them out of at least neutronium. Change it to neutronium so that it makes sense why we can't dig them out. Holy cow, there's a lot of iron ore that we can get. Up to there. And let's dig some of that out. Three, four. 
Food has decayed, that's fine. I don't know why the box here is needing... Oh, we have... Some germ-infected lice loaf, actually. Some of it heavily infected. Although it is dropping in germs, the meal lice is infected? Oh, also consumables. No more no more meal lice. So that's weird. Why is the meal lice infected? That's really weird. Okay, well, how what's the temperature here? 44, not bad. If we can get this entire tank down low enough, even when we get new liquid from down here, it shouldn't be that bad. Is that... Zero... Zero germ surface. I don't see any germs in the pipe. Then again, I can't see the pipe very well. It'd be coming through there. Yeah, I'm not seeing any germs on that. Why is it... Why is it making... Polluted oxygen. <laughs> maybe, it, maybe there's not enough pressure in the area? That could be. Anywho, so... Then we'll have our power system, and then we will cancel this, even though it probably will get cleaned up here in a little. And then we'll have heavy watt that goes, I guess, around that right there, and then up through and up to up here. Because it needs to connect to up here. Do you have this wire right there, though? That's going to have to dodge. So maybe off to the side and then connect into right there. In fact... No, because there's rooms right there. This this little... This little uh, shaft does need to go all the way up to here as well. So... Yeah, so it'll just... Jump to the side right there for a second. And you actually connect right there. So continuing on up the middle would probably be fine. I'll have to change it to a bridge though. Right for for it to connect into the pump. And then that will just go up to say right here and then come over. Yeah. So we'll need to change that into a, what is this, joint plate. We'll just have to change that into a joint plate. Plate. Okay, well, now that most, well, I really do want them to finish it before they do anything else. Also to clean it up, if we could. Oh, we do need another dupe because we did have one die. Bottomless stomach, pacifist, small bladder. I'd rather you going to the bathroom all the time and your germ resistant so rather you going to the bathroom all the time than than what was the other one than eating all the food <laughs> oh really are you still sanitizing that okay deconstruct that and dig that and make that dig a priority nine. Get rid of it. I don't want it there. And wall it off. But yeah, none of this is having issues, I would hope. Yeah, see, that's naturally just decreasing. And there's not even any air on this side, so I don't know... I don't know why the others are having issues. <laughs> Anywho, as they finish that up, yeah, we do have Bonnie in here. 
Oh, we do need a ceiling tile right there, too. We'll need a ladder to get up to it for the time being. We can actually deconstruct this ladder. How's that room doing for oxygen? It is beautiful. So we can actually set up a bed in there. And the reason why I made it so spread out is because it is going to be, it is spaced for, no, out of granite. It is, oh, oops, nope, cancel. <laughs> it is designed for the big beds to be in here. So, sculpting block out of granite. Why would I want it out of anything else? Ceiling light out of iron. And flower pot out of granite. Decor plus five, decor plus five. Okay, so the percentage is just increase that five and whatnot. Yep. Let them all build that all out. And they can sweep up this when they're good and ready. So, anyways, Tasteful Memorial out of sandstone, that's fine. Let's just have a bunch of them. And when they wake up, let's see if they disinfect anything over here. So there was this one tile, but it seems to be cleaning itself so dying on a solid and nothing else is getting infected sue so I'm guessing it's good you copy setting and I know it's like terribly hot in the rooms I'm trying to cool it down I have the air is coming out at 14 degrees over here but it's just it's gonna take a bit for that to spread out Ooh, this one's actually growing it's idle why are you idle hemisphere it doesn't care adds decor and that's it okay yeah okay and they're building those Which takes a while, and they're in an oxygenless atmosphere in while being in there, so... Ooh, wow, that's actually oxygenated all of that really well. Yeah, this room just doesn't get super oxygenated, probably because of that tile. Maybe I should actually replace that as a normal tile. Because that might be a little too much access to the air vent. And it's going to take them a while to get that all built out. So let's kind of think how we're going to do this specifically. What temperature is this? So this is within gold amalgam range for sure. So that's not bad. We have a slickster or two down here, which means and we have a lot of carbon dioxide down here too, so that if we can get that flowing into it. See here, right here's the middle. It will hit this one bleach stone, but if we do actually ladders from there, we can actually have it come all the way down without much issue. We will need atmospheric suits though. This is way too hot for any dupe to be able to go into. So once we get all of the rooms all laid out, unassigned. Who's assigned up here? Ada. Ada, you are now down here. Wait, no, there was Ari or, okay. Ari may, wait, Ari? No, Lindsay, May, and Ada. So the top of the list, Lindsay, May, or Ada? May. This is now yours. 
Whose is this? Gossman? Oh, that's the new person that jumped out. Okay. Well, we'll have four more rooms over here, if nothing else. And that will mean that these two can leave those quarters. And that we can actually start moving machines and stuff to be worked on up here. Hmm. I'm thinking maybe having the bathrooms like down here and here. But I don't know. Let's get some more air tiles in here. Flowing upwards. Just like that. They have a lot of these done, actually. <laughs> I'm actually surprised. And back to work on them. Okay. And we have food being produced, even though we have too much. It's not like it's now taking from anything that's limited. What's the temperature of the water? 45 degrees, approximately. It's going down. But so is this water level really fast. <laughs> So, hmm, oh, and this area is just really hot because of that, too. Hmm. And we have to figure out how to get this in use as well. Because this will be very useful to get, but we have to figure out how we're going to use it. I'm thinking we just put, like, four electrolyzers over here. And all of the hydrogen that goes into that just goes into there. But then that's going to be producing a lot of oxygen, of which I don't know what to use for. <laughs> so, and that's part of the problem is that the base is getting fairly pressurized. So, like, all the vents are consistently complaining. Which is kind of a problem. Like, we do need air, more air pressure down here. But for the most part, the concept being is is that we just need more, or we don't need necessarily, we need to be able to regulate the pressure a little bit more effectively than just continuously producing and hoping it goes somewhere. Which it does, it goes into here when we have polluted oxygen and such, but it's not always effective. Oh, and I, I did realize that the skimmers don't actually output any oxygen. They just emit dirty water. But that's fine, because that actually helps support the clean water. And we were needing some more polluted water to be able to convert. Hmm. Also, maybe we could use the dirty water as coolant... Because those machines are going to be really hot. And they might actually be hot enough to create steam. Although the ones we're thinking about are the ones with carbon dioxide. Right? Uh, power. Petroleum. Yeah, they produce carbon dioxide too. So we're going to have to figure out a way to... Separate the steam and the carbon dioxide, because I do believe that steam is heavier than carbon dioxide. So, if we were to go that route, we would need a separating tower to allow steam to go in one way and the carbon dioxide to go in the other. And then we'd have an air pump on one side, and we'd need the other side to somehow be cooled, like have some cooling pipes going through there. So it's going to be fairly complicated. Maybe having... Because we, we're going to need the generate or the refineries cooled as well. Hmm. That's troublesome. And it's good that I'm planning all this out in ahead of time because if we can get a better way to clean our water other than needing to use sand 
then that's actually going to be very, very beneficial, so. But we do have all of those done. And actually, that is the timer. So that means that's it for the episode. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please do leave a like as it does help the channel. And do subscribe if you're not already to catch the next episode as it comes out. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, please leave those in the comment section below. And I'll get back to you as quick as I can. And I will see you guys in the next one. Oh, oh, their bodies just disappear. Oh my. Well, okay then. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good one. Goodbye.